Asian markets are up 18% this year, which, which is a really strong start to the year. And there've been, there's been great performance across the board if you look at various countries. And, and as you said, the rate hike has been well telegraphed. The market's been expecting this. So I don't see this, this 25 basis point hike having a meaningful impact on the dynamics we're seeing in the market at present. We've got a global export recovery. We see trade volumes improving, and Asia is, is a, is a, has huge exposure to the, to the trade, global trade environment. So I think this is positive environment for, for Asian stock picking. Sarah, can you weigh in on uh, some of these reports that we're seeing that some traders in China think that the PBOC could move in tandem with their interest rates, of course, uh, the short-term rates? Uh, do you think that they would be watching out what the Fed does? They usually basically uh, move to the tune of their own drum. That's right. I think it's really hard to say what China's going to do. China has, has its own agenda. It's a very important year in China, as we know. It's a, it's a big political year. So, so they're very careful not to derail the, the economy and to make sure that things tick along quite smoothly. So what, what they do is, is anyone's guess, but I, I think that it would be a very measured and a response, if any.